hitting a hole in one with this STEAM project. Fourth grade students at Hilton and Island School for the Creative Arts are using the engineering and design process to create their own mini golf courses. Our theme is jungle because when we first got it, the floor was painted green, so it just made it a lot easier. There's a tree in the middle that makes it, and if you don't get into the tree, you go into what we call the sand pit. It's very hard to get out of the sand pit because there's a bunch of popsicle sticks in there. We're doing it based off New York, and we're trying to like, do Spider-Man or like graffiti in buildings. The kids are using cardboard and other recycled materials to build their golf holes. We used boxes, we used blocks, and we also used cardboard. Some of the materials we used was pipe cleaners and sprinkles for the floor to make it glittery. We used felt, cardboard, pipe cleaners, pom-poms. Before building their mini golf courses, students went online and used a golf simulator to better understand angles and how to plan out their designs. Mathematically, they learned about angles and they also learned about the purpose of the obstacle and creating a golf course. They only could do an L shape or a straightaway. So they were able to simulate that when they planned and then when they planned, they drew it out, labeled it, and then they put it to life with building. Students are also using science skills and teamwork as they create their projects. I liked about this project because we're communicating, we're working together, and we have to use angles, so then if you use an angle, say if a block is right here, the goal is right here. So if you hit the ball, it goes right here, it will go that way. We have to use force because like, if we hit the ball hard, then it's gonna go farther. And if we hit the ball with less force, it's gonna go not as far. And they were able to understand kinetic energy, potential energy, and how the obstacle slowed the ball down based on being there to deflect the ball. And they understood the amount of effort and energy put from their body to the golf club to the ball is that transfer of energy. Second grade students are also designing flags for each hole. And friends and family of second and fourth graders will have the chance to play the student-created golf courses by coming to the school's Go Steam Go event January 25th from 5.30 to 7 p.m. The Hilton Head Island Middle School cheer team will also be at the event and there will be several other STEAM activities for families to take part in. Pirates Island Golf donated the use of clubs, balls, and other equipment for people to use. At Hilton Head Island School for the Creative Arts, Ron Lopes, Buford County School District.